Hey everybody, I'm back with another story time today. This is a story I really like because I love one of the characters in it. It's the character Thumper from the movie Bambi, and I just love Thumper. So we're gonna find out what Thumper's up to in this story, and it's called Thumper Finds a Friend. And let's see who his special friend is. <clears throat> Under the warm, bright summer sun, Thumper and his sisters played tag in the forest. One bunny chased and one bunny wriggled. One bunny ducked and one bunny giggled. And one bunny dove for cover. Look at all those cute bunnies. I love bunny rabbits. Do you like bunny rabbits? They're really cute. And the bunny discovered someone who was trying not to be found. Ooh, any guesses what that animal is that Thumper found? Let's see. Hello, Thumper said. Want to play tag? The hedgehog stirred and started, then stumbled and tumbled. So it was a hedgehog. Hedgehogs are cute too. But she didn't answer. Instead, she tucked her head down and rolled herself into a prickly little ball. Thumper was puzzled. Didn't she want to be his friend? I don't know. We'll have to see. Thumper really wants to be her friend, though. Maybe he could make her laugh. He looked for something soft and tickly. Flick, flick, feather flick. The hedgehog giggled, but Thumper didn't hear. Your moms and dads, your brothers and sisters ever tickle you? It's fun. Then Thumper had another idea. He would give her something sweet. Skippity skip, skip, skip. He hopped to a berry patch and picked some treats. Those berries look very nice. Thumper put some berries next to the hedgehog and waited, but she was silent and still. Thumper was stumped. Didn't the berries smell good? Didn't they taste good? I don't know, I think those berries look pretty good. What do you think? Sniff, sniff, gulp. Yes, they were delicious. At least Thumper thought so. But the hedgehog still hadn't said anything. Thumper didn't know what to do. He hopped over to his father. Papa, he said, why won't the hedgehog be my friend? I've been really nice. Papa Bunny smiled. Not everyone makes friends right away. Give her a little time, he said. Thumper nodded and hopped over to his sisters. Boys and girls, think about when you first came to school. Was it a little hard to make friends at first? It was, but then you got to know each other and talk and you guys got to be good friends. So you just have to give it some time. Just like Thumper has to be a little more patient. Thumper and his sister scampered and chased. They darted and they raced, but still no hedgehog. Well, at least it looks like the bunnies are having some fun. The bunnies jumped and joked. They leaped and they laughed, but still no hedgehog. Lots of time had gone by. Thumper crept toward the tree. Want to be my friend, he called. But the hedgehog was gone, gone. Then Thumper heard a small voice. Hello, it said, may I play? Oh, this is making me happy. I think they're gonna be friends. So that afternoon, under a warm, bright summer sun, five little bunnies and one little hedgehog played tag in the forest. The hedgehog chased while one bunny wriggled and one bunny slid, one bunny giggled and one bunny hid, and one bunny smiled. Because he had made a new friend.
the end. I hope you liked today's story. I love reading about different animals and Thumper is one of my favorites. Have a wonderful rest of your week and I'll see you for another story time next week. Bye everybody.